Good morning, Barstow. And Camille, what are you doing? Oh, sorry. I was just looking at the score from last night's baseball game. Oh, right. I forgot we had one. Well, how did we do? I'll talk about it more after the intro. Back to the baseball news, the team played really well last night, beating St. Michael's 14-5. They have another game against St. Michael's again tonight at home at 5 p.m., so I'm sure that they would love a big Barstow crowd. Make sure to show up in support, and good luck to everyone playing. Hey Story, do you like watching baseball? Yeah, I like watching the Royals games. They're my favorite MLB team. Yeah, me too. Speaking of the MLB, let's watch this piece that Carson made about MLB predictions. Los Angeles Dodgers, they're my favorite team, so they're going to win the World Series. Bryce Harper wins the NL MVP. Astros are going to be back in it. I think they're winning it all again because they're going to cheat again because there's some cheaters. Manny Machado of the Padres gonna go, is going to carry the, the Padres. Aaron Judge is going to break his own record from last year. I think Royals will win World Series. Um, when Tatis's suspension is over, he's going to come back and destroy everyone. Billy Butler's going to do well. The Royals winning it all, 100%. Like, have you not seen their team? Like, the last three years, bro, they insane. Brady Singer wins the AL Scion Award. Trust. My MLB season prediction is that it's going to be Mariners Padres in the World Series. I'm hoping for the Tampa Bay Rays to make a playoff push, but... I gotta be, I gotta be reasonable here. So Mariners, Padres, and Padres get the World Series dub. No, I think that the Rays are actually gonna win because they have, um, as I have researched, they have a better chance to be in the playoffs. So, and a World Series prediction. So uh, the Los Angeles Angels are gonna make the playoffs. <laughs> Thanks, Carson. We'll have to come back and see if any of these predictions come true. We have a few important announcements, starting off with College Information Night for freshmen and their parents on April 19th at 6.30 p.m. in Price Hall. A lot, of, uh, a lot is covered in the meeting about finding the right school, and Mr. Hill usually has treats and prizes, so make sure to go. I will definitely be attending that. This Thursday, the 3rd and 4th grade Spring Music Concert is in the auditorium at 9 a.m., with the reception following from 9.30 to 10.15 in the dining hall. Girls Soccer has a home game tonight against Guadalupe Centers High School at 5 p.m. Let's hope for a Barstow victory. In other sports news, the boys tennis team opened their season with a big win defeating Lee's Summit. The Knights continue their demanding schedule tonight at Barstow versus 2022 Class 3 state champ Pembroke Hill. If I didn't have a soccer game, I would definitely make sure to go to the tennis match. You know, I don't really know much about the tennis team here at Barstow. Well, perfect for that us because Liam and Will made a piece introducing the boys tennis team. Let's take a look. Coach O'Brien, I've been coaching here. This is my 17th year here, I think. Uh, maybe 18th, uh, probably 40 some year coaching tennis all in all. A couple things I see. First of all, we're further ahead, uh, I think, than we normally are this time of year. I don't know if it's because we've had a, a pre, pretty good weather break or these guys is just, uh, whatever, they're just playing well. And I especially like the way we're playing doubles. It seems that everybody's movement is ahead of the game so far. Uh, what I like about this squad more than maybe uh, any other year that I can recall is, is our depth. Normally we've really relied on one and two and then hope to pick up something in the middle. This time I think we are as strong from number two to six. We're all pretty pretty even and we're all pretty solid. So I'm gonna expect a lot out of the middle and bottom of our lineup this year. I think that uh, we've got some, a couple good teams. We're up a class because of our previous success. And we have a couple good teams that out there, one in particular out of Joplin that we'll need to beat. 
to do it. Uh, they're a good team, and, and we're pretty even. So, yeah, I think we've got a good shot of, of getting it done if we play well. Uh, you know, I like our chances of, of at least having a good shot to the Final Four. After that, who knows? I'm Sonny. I've been playing tennis for seven years. I think we'll make it, I hopefully we'll make it to Springfield again yeah. to Final Four. I'm George Colombo. Um, I'm a senior. I feel like we have a great chance of winning state. Um, definitely going to state, like Coach said. Um, yeah, we have great success in our doubles, which is what's probably going to help us the most getting there. My name is Aram Salam. I'm a senior, and I'm your boys' as captain. I see a lot of improvement. Everybody's improving every day, and uh, yeah, I think like I think I think we're in a pretty good position, and I think it's only going to go up from here the more we play. Come out, support, and watch the games. Otherwise, you're not a true Bostonian. Mic drop. Wow, I definitely learned a lot from that piece. Thanks, guys. Well, it looks like we're out of time. I'm Story. And I'm Camille. Have a great day, Barstow.